Hey guys, it's Dana with Engadget. I'm here with Toby. This is a company that makes eye tracking technology. And when we last saw them at CES last year, their, their technology was more of a concept. And now they've released this USB powered peripheral called the Rex, which brings eye tracking technology to any Windows 8 computer. For now, it's only available to developers for around $1,000, but there's going to be a limited edition consumer version that comes out in the fall. So I'm here to just give you a quick update on the technology. As before, you can scroll, you can select things, you can zoom in, but now there are keyboard shortcuts that help you accomplish this. It's not just something you do with the touchpad, which was the case last year. So first, I'm going to show you what it's like to select something. So let's see, I'm going to look at the Finance app here, and what I'm going to do is hold down the Delete key in the lower right corner of my keyboard. So I'm looking at the Finance app, and there we go. It, it, it shows that. I'm going to try it one more time. So I want to go to local files over there. So I'm looking straight at that. Boom, it's still so accurate. I haven't, this hasn't messed up once in the, the several minutes I've been testing this. Now, let's try this actually, using my eyes. I'm gonna go to Internet Explorer. So now what I wanna do is scroll through. So I'm gonna hold down the insert key and I'm gonna look toward the part of the page I wanna to scroll to. So I'm gonna move down the page like that. I'm going to move back up. You'll see that the only limit here is that there's a limit to how fast the scrolling goes. You might still scroll faster if you're using a mouse. So, last thing I want to show you is zooming. So let's use maps for that. Here we go into maps. And here I'm going to scroll all the way out. Now let's go somewhere in the world. I'm going to pick a very small country. I'm going to pick Lithuania over there. And using my eyes, I'm going to keep my eyes there and then I'm going to keep my fingers on the scroll button of my mouse. And here we go. We're zooming right in on Lithuania. So as you can see, it's very accurate. It's a much more polished experience than we saw last year. So the next step, obviously, is for consumers to get this in their hands in the form of this peripheral later this year. And then eventually, hopefully, the technology will be incorporated directly into, into devices so that you don't need to buy this expensive peripheral to go with it. Thanks a lot for watching. This is Dana with Engadget.